Right guys, this is Mario Kart Arcade DX version 1.18.16 Pretty much the same as everyone, but I've added an English translation mod to it So it's, the writing and everything is no longer in Japanese, it's actually in English um, But if you have my standalone already this this mod will not work on it as it is. You have to use a lot of files from the Techno Power Up version, so the actual mod picks it up. It's the right version of the game for you to install the patches. So, if you've got my original standalone, which does work online, then you'll have to ask me for the new version of it if you want to play it in English. So, for the new people, um, you have a fix here, otherwise you just have a black screen. And these two, you go to C, Windows, and all you do is drop these two folders in there, and then then it will stop you getting the um, black screen issue. So you've got System32 and you've got the WoW one here. So you just drop them two in, then that's it. So for your controls, you can use Jconfig, but I wouldn't change too much in here, otherwise it, it really just go tits up. So leave it all the same. And here you can change it, but I don't think it works in keys because I remember trying it before on direct input and it has to be on X input with quote said thread for joysticks and click OK. The other thing is it runs really fast on this new mod uh, and it won't slow down for some reason. So there's two ways to do it. One is um, I'm using MSI Afterburner. This is a program that's free and you can download it. And once you've downloaded it, it also install um, Reba Tuner as well, which is here. So you just click on Reba Tuner, then you can add the game. So go to Add. I want to go to F. Oh, arcade standalones. So I've got the English one here. And you click on the EXE, go to open. And it'll be here. And then you can change your refresh rate. So I'm going to have 60. Bloody thing. So that will make it run at 60 frames per second. With, um, you can also do it with the video control panel. So right click the screen, bring it up. Then you go to manage 3D settings. And if you go to program settings, you then find the EXE like I've just done on M. MSI Afterburner and you can change your frame rate um, <laughs> I know it's here somewhere uh, max frame rate so you can change this to 60 here on the game Also in Jconfig, don't change the graphic settings, otherwise it don't go through screen properly and it will cock up the game. Then just start over with this one here.
It takes a while to load. But it isn't too bad. See, all this was in Japanese before, and now even this is in English.
guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. It's already uploaded, so just send me emails. You know, so I haven't been on for a while, just been, I haven't been well for quite a few days, and I've been helping people move for a week, and I've just been absolutely knackered, coming home, not eating, just getting in bed, pretty much. But hope you enjoyed it, guys.